Whoa. Hey, there's another. Uh, what's that? Nocturnal grasshopper. Uh oh. Run. Think he's a little tougher. Am I safe in here? Ooh. Oh. Oh. Uh. Can he come in? Oh. Check it out. <laughs> he wants to. <laughs> Can he do damage to my base? Oh. Oh, he is. Darn it. Hey everybody, welcome back to Small Land. Alright, I've been trying to figure out where I want to build my base. I've been gathering some resources up. I still, I know I've seen some video, if you climb one of those trees, uh, you, it's a good place to build a base, but I haven't figured out which tree I'm supposed to climb yet. So, uh, I want to, and I want to look at the, I want to take a look at the crafting bench and see what we can craft. Maybe that tree is what you're supposed to climb, I'm not sure. i got to figure that out. But for right now, I kind of like this area right here. Uh, I don't think these butterflies attack you. I've, I haven't been attacked by them yet, so, but I kind of like this little area right here. Uh, it's close to the, if we look at the map, uh, it's kind of close to where we spawn and the Elder and Hearn. Uh, but I don't know, I thought it looked like a nice spot. There's lots of places to explore. There's, uh, there's some kind of big building over there, and I don't know if that, I don't know what that little hole is over there, if that's a cave or what's going on. There's ants down there. But uh, I want to build the craft, the workbench, and see what we can, what, what we can get. If we can get a better weapon out of the crafting bench, I haven't built one of those yet. So, and we need to repair some of our tools, like our torch is about shot. So it's uh, it's about midday. So let's go ahead and get our hammer out, and let's just lay down a base here, and we'll do, we'll do something small. Not too big because you know I don't know how long I'm gonna be living here. Single bed. We'll put that right here. And let's go ahead and set that as our spawn point. There we go. Now if we look at our map. Yeah, it moved the sp our spawn point was over here. Now we will spawn here at our house. All right, now let's put some walls up. Get our hammer back out. Let's put a window here. All right, I'm really curious. <laughs> If I can uh, attack these butterflies or not, they seem friendly. Spin that around. There we go. And then we got regular walls. Let's see where we're gonna put our door at. Very simple building this game. Just perfect. Uh oh, we got a storm coming. Let's get a roof on our head, over our head, quickly. Let's use the leaf roof. Alright, perfect. Now, uh, let's see, do we have a door? That appears to be correct. Yeah. Now, do we have any lights? Let's see, we have to do our hammer uh, decorations. Chair, twig torch. Can we hang that on the wall? Hopefully. Perfect. A little high. There we go. Now, can I move it once I have placed it? Dismantle C. There we go. Yeah, 
and get three sources back. Beautiful. Okay. Let's put another one there. Put it on the floor. Yeah. Alright, very cool. We got lighting. We've got our bed. Let's save and let's pop open the workbench. I'm sorry, let's craft the workbench, I mean. Uh, so we go back to our hammer. And interactive. We can make a chest and a workbench. It's a big workbench. Alright, let's go right here. Stone cutter, build a structure. Oh, we'll get, we unlocked the stone cutter, okay. Uh, let's see, we gotta have a fire. Can our fire go inside? Oh, it can. Very nice. Alright, that's a pretty cool looking little place. I like it. Nice and lit up well. Alright, uh, now let's see. Oh, the last thing I'm going to put is a uh, storage chest. Right there. I don't know what the little star means. Uh, let's see. Let's put, let's put it right here. Now let's put it right here. I'll probably have more than one. Okay, so the the butterfly is like flying into our base. All right, let's see how much this holds. Simple chest, twelve slots. Okay. All right, now let's see a workbench. I need. I want to repair some of our tools. Repair. Perfect. Torch needs wood and resin. Awesome. Wood club. I love this. It tells you what needs to be repaired. You click on repair. That's cool. Alright, now let's see if we can get a better weapon. Wood sword. Edge damage 8 to 11. And our wood club is six to eight, definitely. Uh, oh, cool! We can make a bow. We gotta do that. All right, let's make a wood sword. Uh, what I need? Oh, I need more wood. Okay. Arrows. Standard arrow made of wood. How many does it give me? One. All right. How many? Do, how many arrows did it give me? Ten. Oh, that's beautiful. Thank you, developer. Ten arrows. That's that's definitely fair. All right. So I need more wood, and I need more. Yeah, to, to make my bow. So I'll grab some more wood. Now, see, I got this butterfly just jacking with me here. <laughs> now we have a sword. Can we kill a butterfly? Oh, I can. We took a little damage. Oh, they just fly away. Okay. <laughs> He's not really scared of me. Alright, well, at least they don't attack me. Alright, let me go gather up some wood. And... And we'll try out our bow and arrow on those ants down there. Oh, it's a grasshopper. Oh. Do I want to take on the grasshopper? Okay, there's a different plant. Can I... It needs a crude hatchet, okay? Oh, I need to have a better hatchet for that. All 
All right, Mr. Grasshopper. He doesn't look like he really wants to hurt me. I can't process, or I can't uh, get that resource yet. Blunt damage. All right, so does that mean my wood club is better? Vul oh, that's pretty cool. Vulnerabilities, blunt damage. Does that mean my wood club is better then? Blunt damage six to eight. Edge damage. I guess that means this is better. Let's try it out. What do we have to lose? I think we got him. There we go. Cool. Oh, grasshopper scythe. Oh, nice. Okay, that opened up a new recipe for us. Yeah, I like how our, our uh, base is lit up. Cool. All right, we gotta get some wood. Uh, I think I can hold my. Yeah, I can hold my torch. And I can harvest. But I need wood. I don't need. Sprout so much, I need, I need wood. Oh, hey, there's another. Uh, what's that? Nocturnal grasshopper. Uh oh, run. I think he's a little tougher. Am I safe in here? Ooh. Oh, 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 uh. Can he come in? Oh, check it out. <laughs> he wants to. <laughs> Can he do damage to my base? Oh, oh, he is. Darn it. Okay, I need some food. Can I just heal up by here? Standing here? I do have a little food. Uh, bandage. I don't have any bandages. Go away. I want to make this... Oh, refined wood. Okay. Ladybug travel kit. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, special treat to tame a ladybug. As well as backpacks designed to attach their four wings, providing additional storage space for the ladybug to carry. Oh, we can tame a ladybug. Oh, that's awesome. I thought maybe standing by the fire I would heal. We are healing up a little bit. It's dark anyway. I think we. I think if we sleep, we should uh, heal up. Let's try that. We did. We got to 83. Now it's gonna rain. All right. Well, this will help us heal up. Let's go ahead. We have some stuff we can cook. We could do mushroom steak. Alright, that is right here. Alright, how to make a bandage? Maybe that's something we have to unlock. Alright, let let's see, do we have a weight limit? I don't think we do. I'm gonna store like some resin in here. Let's go ahead and repair all this stuff. We took a little damage. Alright, so I got Oh, here's a simple bandage right here. Sorry. Oh, just fiber. Alright, I want to make some more bandages for sure. Alright, I think I got my... I got my hot bar situated the way I want it. Now, let's go find some wood. Uh, hopefully, that grasshopper got bored and went away. I need to find some more wood so I can make a bow. Well, I'm gonna take this grasshopper on again. Come here. We did get some resources from him that we can use. There we go. Uh, let's 
go ahead and use a bandage. All right, so it's cool that uh, we can tell what what weapon works best on different creatures. That's neat. Now I don't want to kill the ladybugs. Uh oh, ants! Hey, <gasps> see our sword does. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah, the sword is definitely better. Ant head, that might be good for something, I'm sure. Hey, gosh, what is that? A bull ant. Oh, gosh. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, guys. It scared me to death. Oh, another one. Well, we should be able to make something with that. Dang, that thing was big. Uh, there's another one down there. Alright, uh, let's see. How much wood do we have? I don't know how many I needed to... Oh, we only have 11. I need more than that. What's this? Bottle cap. Okay. Sure that's useful somewhere. Oh, this looks like a whole, just a whole anthill. That's another one. You got nothing for me, buddy. I hear another one, though. Oh, gosh, there's another one. Mm-hmm. I wonder if we cook those. All right, let's go back and see... If I've got it, oh, here's some more twigs. Let's see if I got enough to make my bow. It's a scary world we live in here. I heard another. I heard another ant somewhere. Oh, there he is. Baby, baby ant. You got nothing. You still scare me. <laughs> you got nothing for me, but you scare me. <laughs> oh. Oh, ladybug. Okay, thought it was none of those red, none of those red ants. Okay, we're getting close to our base. Uh oh. All right, I need to get back to shelter. We got rain coming. I see it all nice and lit up over there. That's handy. Where the butterflies fly. home safely. Now, let's see if this if there's anything new that I can cook. Grilled grasshopper legs. To make the scythe, though. Yeah, I better hang on to that. I think I have another one over here, don't I? Yeah. Can I just right-click? Yeah. Beautiful. Insect fat. Uses common green and recipes for cakes, pies, and cookies. Okay, I'll save that. Uh, I'll save the bottle cap. Alright, we can make our bow now. Simple bow. And... Make more arrows. What's a fire arrow? Stone and insect fur. Okay. Oh, more fiber. Okay. I've got fiber. I don't have fiber. Okay. Well, I've got 20 arrows. Now, what's this insect do? Ant head. Hard to sturdy, great for protection, yet deliciously crunchy when cooked. Oh, I can cook that. Ant skewer. There we go. Is it good for anything else other than cooking? I don't know. 
Right now, I think I need the food. We'll get more ant heads, I'm sure. Alright, let's see what we got now for our food. Right here. Nourishment 30. The mushrooms are 30. So I need to gather up some more plant fiber. Bull ant mandible. Perfect for crafting a durable pickaxe, yet delicious and crunchy when grilled. Oh, I can make a pickaxe with that. There we go. Uh, oh, I just need fiber. Alright, we gotta get some fiber. I wanna make a pickaxe. We should be. We still got daylight left. Just go find some fiber. Head back and craft the. Let's head back and craft our pickaxe. Maybe I'll get some more fiber along the way. Yeah. Here's an owl we haven't seen yet. Equipment deteriorates with use and will progressively lose its effectiveness. Make sure to keep your equipment in good order by repairing it before that happens. You can repair the items at the workbench, okay? Alright, well we need that. Uh oh. We just lost our. We just lost our torch. Fortunately, I can make a new one. Alright, so I'm trying to get back to my base so we can make this pickaxe. Let's sleep through the night. Oh, that's pretty cool. These mushrooms light up. Huh? Okay, well, I can cut them down. Oh, hello, Mr. Grasshopper. Uh, I don't want to take you on right now. Oh, no choice. Oh, that's the nocturnal one. Darn it. Bandage. I need a bandage. Oh, he got me. Okay, so when we die, um, okay, I didn't lose my club or my torch. Don't have any materials. All right, so it's the first time I've died. Okay, we're right here. Okay, so I should be able to make it back. Get all my stuff. We we're so close to being home. I don't know how long our stuff will last either. Oh, there's another owl up there. Is this? The spirit of the great tree is listening. What is it that you wish to Vanguard? I want to climb this tree and move my tree encampment here. Oh. Well, that's what I've been looking for. Oh, so close. Okay. So we'll get our stuff and then we'll come back to that. It's right by our base. Okay, cool. Ah, uh, stinking ants. Can I just outrun them? I don't know if I can outrun them or not. Carpenter Ant Warrior. Ooh, okay. 
can't die again. Ah. Shoot. I don't know what happens if you die again. I don't want to find out. Back to my stuff, I've got bandages. Is this it? Wow, made it. Oh, hey, oh gosh, <laughs> oh gosh. Seriously, <laughs> I just make it back to my stuff and I get one shotted by. The B. Oh man. Okay, guys, I was able to get my stuff back, retrieve my body. It was actually, I was very close to the base. So now uh, I should have enough to make that pickaxe. So let's check that out. Let's see, how am I doing on food? I need to eat something. We'll eat an ant skewer. I killed some more ants along the way. So we should be able to... Well, only one. Oh, I got mushrooms. Let's make those. And we know where those are. Those are cool. Those are light up at night. Uh, let's see. I definitely need, need to repair all my tools. Repair everything. Took some serious damage. Okay. Now... Do we ever craft the bow? No, because I need fiber. We've got we got uh, 20 arrows. All right, now we're gonna put our bow. Let's we'll move move our torch to here. Building hammer here, and we'll put our bow slot three. There we go. And I want to see if we can craft the pickaxe. There we go. And let's see. Let's put it in number five. There we go. Now our bow. We can crouch. Need to equip an arrow to use the bow. How do I equip? Uh, use equip. Right click. Oh, put it over here. Can we retrieve our arrows? Please, please. I can't retrieve my arrows. Darn it! All right, developer. Please. Please make it we can retrieve our arrows. I know they're cheap, but still, it's a big thing. Alright, I gotta shoot something. Grasshopper? What kind of range this thing has? Ooh, big drop. Got him. He did not like that. Alright, want blunt damage on the grasshopper. Come here, chump. Uh-oh. Alright, he took a beating. Okay, so I like the well, the bow's got a little big drop. And it keeps track of our arrows here. Okay, we can't get our arrows back. A little disappointed in that. 
All right, let's let's go see if we can find uh, some stone. And oh, I want to talk to this guy over here too. That's the. This is the guy that I was trying to find. I think let's go let's see what happens. I think he takes us to the top of the tree. I believe. I'm gonna find out. The spirit of the great tree is listening. What is it that you wish? I want to climb this tree and move my tree encampment here. You do not have a tree encampment yet. To claim your first tree and make your encampment, you must climb to the top of a great tree and speak to me there. Oh. Okay. Alright. So we gotta climb the tree. But how do I know where to start on the tree? Okay. I'll get that figured out. Um. And maybe we'll do we'll probably do that next episode. Alright, now we're just gonna find some kind of rock. I hear something. What do I hear? Probably ant. Oh, there's an ant, yeah. I'll I'll use you for food, buddy. Yeah. This sword's nice for the ants. definitely worth building that. Alright, I'm just going to try to find some kind of rock. We can try our try out our pickaxe. Huh. Oh. Alright, I didn't want I didn't mean to jump that far. It on this rock. No. Dang, there's ants everywhere. They're hard to see, too. Can I not use it on that? Alright, maybe this rock down here. Ooh, maybe that's how we get flint. Oh, I need flint or something. Alright, um... Five. Here we go. What I get? Just stone. All right. Well. I'm sure that stone is good for something. Yeah, I hear you. Where you at? Oh, there you are. Oh, man. Alright. Let's go back. Back to our base. I always get caught out in the rain. All right, we made it safely back to our base. All right, so I'm gonna end this one here, guys. Uh, we got a lot done today. I'm real happy with what we got done, and uh, I'll figure out that tree thing, how to climb that tree, and we'll probably end up moving our base up there. So, if you like this episode, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, make sure that subscribe button. I do appreciate each and every way that subscribes. And come back and see me for more episodes of Small Land. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.